A Google Pixel 8 might be unable to send MMS due to the mobile data not enabled, as MMS requires an active data connection to be sent. Other potential causes include poor signal reception, software glitches that can be resolved by restarting the phone, or issues with the network settings that may require a reset. The initial step is to verify if the mobile data is enabled on your device. You can typically enable mobile data by navigating to the settings menu and selecting network and internet. Tap SIMS and select your network. Now, ensure that the mobile data toggle is turned on. The next thing you have to do is to check the signal, as poor signal reception can lead to this problem. Just take a look at the signal strength on the status bar. If the reception is poor, try relocating to an area with better signal reception. Another thing you need to do is to restart your device, as it can often rectify minor issues that may be causing this problem. To restart your device, press the power button and the volume up key to view the power menu. Tap on restart and your Pixel 8 will reboot immediately. Wait until it becomes active again and then try sending an MMS to see if it goes through this time. If not, then proceed to the next solution. If you're still facing issues with your device, you may need to reset the network services. This will clear the cache and data of the network settings on your device and you will need to set up your network settings again. Just open the Settings app. Scroll down and tap System. Scroll down again and tap Reset Options. Then select Reset Mobile Network Settings and tap Reset Settings. Follow a few on-screen instructions and the network services will be reset. After that, check to see if the problem is fixed. If not, then it could be an account-related issue or a problem with the network. If none of the above troubleshooting procedures work, it may be time to contact your service provider. They may be able to troubleshoot your device or provide you with additional support to resolve the issue. We hope that this troubleshooting guide can help you in some way. Thanks for watching.